Coming to light for a man accused of sex crimes against minors. The total now climbing into the hundreds. The hundreds. Stephen Hernandez live now with what we're learning on this case that sadly, Stephen, it doesn't seem like it's anywhere close to being over. If I would have knew that my neighbor was like that and everything, like, I would have murdered that guy. A whole community is angered and blindsided as the list of charges keeps growing and growing. With a new indictment, David James III faces 110 counts for sexual crimes against eight juveniles. Streetsboro Police Chief Trisha Wayne says this case is one of a kind. I've never seen a case this large that involved real life victims in person. According to police, James tormented his victims since 2004. The kids he allegedly targeted were between the ages of under 10 to 17. The charges include counts of rape, unlawful sexual conduct, and possession of child pornography. The list of charges that we have against him, I think, speaks for itself. Chief Wayne says it wasn't until one of these victims came forward two months ago that an investigation kicked off. I don't think any of us can comprehend the strength it takes a child to come forward. James was finally arrested at the end of March. Neighbors wondering how something so sickening could happen so close to home. Who does that to kids? I had two kids, you know? Now, police are hoping to find any other victim in this case. I hope there's none. Um, I think it's possible that, that he is far reaching. Success to me or the, the best possible outcome, um, he doesn't get back out ever. As the legal process takes its course, all the community has is a somber reminder that these monsters can be anywhere. Like, I don't understand why, why guys are so sick nowadays, you know? Now, if anyone has information on James, you can reach out to the police at the dispatch number 330-626-4976. But the police in the community hoping James can face the full extent of the law. In Strongsville, in Streetsboro, Stephen Hernandez, 19 News. Well.